Welcome back. This is Nidmach from Fallen Angels. And we last time we ended up taking everything from area number five. We were about to head num to area number six, where there is three sigils and one star. Just three sigils, that usually mean they are hard because the less they are in the area, the more time you're gonna spend taking them. Let's see what these are all about. Elohim talks about how the world across that how the world array arose from hidden word what if those words were let there be eternal suffering what if they had no purpose what if all of this is just randomly synthesized from garbage of the dead world our purpose can only be achieved by not contemplating a purpose they are answering each other and i don't think both of them are right here is another this sound is all ego isn't it recording these random thoughts these letters to the future just a desperate grab for immortality but you should know yes this was my idea my project but so many people helped people i don't even know people i haven't even met who can do things i don't even begin to understand that if we succeeded, if someone's listening to this, I really can't take credit for it. What we achieved, we achieved together. And if we fail, well, it doesn't matter. So, um, there's a sigil right here. Is this important? Three is no, there is no reality. Words lie. Oh, he's just a desperate soul. Anyway. So there's a barrier right here with a lot of things going on inside. We can ask for help here. As we know, another dead area with tombs. People are buried here. And then we have a jammer. So this is our first jammer in this area. This is the only barrier we can interact with. But we gotta be careful of these drones. They're everywhere. We need to go inside anyway, so we try to be careful, try to avoid them as much as we can. There's a gate here, it's closed. Another jammer. Okay, there's a lot, oh, there's a lot of machine guns, so we need the other jammers then, huh? We need to open the gate from this side, like, oh. Okay, 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 don't be, don't be angry, don't be angry. I'm just a visitor. I need to see that gate right here. The, oh, not this one, that one. Now we can go grab the other one. And we have to be careful. Because we want to avoid them. They are in synchronized, so that's good. That means we can go around them. Now we can open this one, grab this one, and then go do it from the other side as we learn from the two jammer technique. Now we can grab this one with us because there's another machine gun right here. Is there another thing? Oh, there's another barrier. Okay. So this one, close this one. This one attached to a wire. Oh, there is, we can disable it right here and grab this one okay so this is the barrier all this is was for the key now we need to head back so we need to head back and the gate is right there beside this opening let's open this from this side take this one and now we can actually free the two jammers open the gate Grab our first jammer. Oh, there's another barrier, so we need the other one. Before this one comes, we can sneak in. There is your first sigil. This wasn't hard, but it takes some time because you need to uh, coordinate your movements. The other two are harder. This one, for example, gave me a lot of hard time. And you're gonna see why in a second. So, there's another area here, there's a jammer right here, 
you need to jam it from this side so you can take the reflector open this gate oh, really okay now we can oh we can go in actually there's another reflector right here and then we can take this box the only purpose for the box for the time being is to hold the pressure switch so we can free the jammer the jammer is essential to this area here because we need to know what's on the other side here there is another barrier here and there is a reflector right there so we need to open it we need to take the jammer in but how that's a good question we can actually hold this door from this side take this one because the purpose of this reflector is only to open this door so we can take it from here if we can open this door with that that would be great yeah there it is now it's open we can take this as with us and open this barrier to take the jammer so we have another jammer here there is a drone there's a barrier here and there's another barrier on the other side okay so the first thing we think we can think of is we need a jammer inside because we need it as for the barrier there or the drone so we need to take the jammer in we cannot hold this door from here because I cannot see the reflector from here I should be able to if I move this one I need to move it all the way to here so if I put this one here so I can see it from that side from the from the beginning there I can move this one a little bit to include this one in the circle this one is closed of course now we need to open this so we can adjust this one so we can include the other one right there okay okay maybe here no it's hitting the wall so we need it a little bit to the side like here for example oh yeah this is good see now all I need is open the gate or the barrier See the jammer did a lot for us now this one is open we can take the jammer inside let's see we have a drone and another receiver here so we need the drone for sure to take it inside to freeze that drone and we need another another uh, beam for this one so we need another receiver inside actually this is gonna be tricky because we need another if we open this we can actually take this one with us because this one is self-sustaining this one is only opening this door so by the jammer put jamming this door let's make sure it's jammed it okay we can take this one with us Okay, now we can take it. So, oh, we don't need that. So now we are trapped inside because there's too many barriers outside, but we have everything we need, I guess. So, what's now? Let's open this gate from this side and take all these reflectors inside from here. This is the first one. We don't need this because this is jammed we can do the other one from here okay let's uh freeze the drone and then take from here to here here we go second sigil this this gate is open but if you can see there is a star right there this is the only star in this uh in this game in this area right there on the other side so it's uh, in the other area actually which is this one here and this one is a little bit complicated because you have a lot of areas to go through and you have a recorder and then you have at the end of it a star 
so uh let's give it a try um the first thing to do is open this and then use the jammer to open two barriers because one is used as a pressure switch the other one is a jammer and then we have three barriers open if you step on this and look closely you can see there is a, re a receiver right there where my cursor is so we need to get that uh, reflector all the way to there but it's all the way there so it's better to bring it closer because this gate can be opened by receiver too so we need to flip them we need that receiver to open this gate and this jammer opened these two in the in the beginning so let's uh let's make the first recording and what we're gonna do is we're gonna just give us some time to bring that reflector all the way to here to open this one and flip the position of this jammer so we get a closer um, reflector that's uh, usually how I like work because I want things to be closer to me so all I need to do is put it right here and then take the jammer and flip its position now I can stop the recording because I don't need it here the jammer opened the first two gates and the reflector opened the third gate now i am gonna record again and let him just stand here stand here and open this barrier for me when i stop recording i will let me just record first because i don't want to explain it two times let's just record make him all, come all the way and stand right here now let's give us more time because uh, i want to bring the reflector a copy of the reflector take the beam all the way to this receiver here while standing on this pressure point so there's two barriers now open with that reflector this one with the pressure the next one and then take a copy of that uh, um, jammer to open the last barrier and take the sigil but it's important to give yourself enough time in this area because every time you made a mistake if you take that reflector for example and open that gate and then the recording ends this gate will be closed and you will be trapped here believe me it happened to me too many times so it's better to give yourself enough time than to be trapped and start all over so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take a copy and let him open it take this one and this one and then open two gate with it and then go back to take a copy of that um, uh, jammer to take the sigil now we took the sigil now we can uh, take it and uh, end the recording because we don't need it anymore all we need to do now the the uh, star is right there which we see it from the other side when we when we were in the next area we saw it from there the star is right there all we need to do with the star is uh, let's go in the recording first well so we can start from the beginning now no no recording anyway so you need to come here open this barrier go record yourself because this is the only thing you need to do to get that star you need enough time to go back get, grab that uh, copy of that uh, uh, jammer open the two barriers one as a pressure switch the other one as a jammer and take the they take the star and that's all what you need to do give yourself like 20 seconds and then stop recording go that's all we need to do to take that star see this one will stay open and then this one can be opened this this way both are open now that's why I said if the recording end now the first gate here this one will be closed and I will be trapped here so give yourself enough time every time this one is disappeared because the recording is done here we are we took two we took uh, all the sigils and all the star one star actually from this area and we're done let's head back 
Did we did we listen to the uh My yeah, faith we did. in you was not misplaced. Okay. You have learned much and shown great wisdom in these trials. The end of your journey lies close now. Do not falter, do not fear, and do not give in to temptation. Okay, it's good to know. So we just finished area six, and the only thing remaining in this uh, temple is area number seven. Uh, the next video, when we finish one the seven, we w this gate will be open, and we'll see the first ending of this game, which is the uh, eternity ending. After we do this uh, and finish the ending, we will load a save game and we will continue with the two other endings the messenger ending and then the tower ending and after that we'll play the road to Johanna so hope to see you all in the next video